Hey y'all, grand night. This is your girl, Comedic Medium Prophetess, and I'm back with another video. I'm back with a channeled message. This is going to be a blackout message, a late night channeled message. So, um, I've been getting this download for about two or three days now, but um, I haven't put it out. Uh, spirit, put I can. Somebody don't want me to get this out, y'all. <laughs> crazy, crazy. Somebody don't want me to get this shit out. The enemy don't want me speaking. Y'all see how my words was trying to get tied up? But yeah, spirit has literally been nudging on me to put this message out. But I've been kind of uh, busy with things, you know, just living life, um, doing everyday things throughout the day. And I kind of forgot about the download, but it always creeps back up on me at nighttime so this is going to be a quick download i don't know who this is for i don't believe that this is anybody that i know but uh here's the download uh but before i before i say the download we're gonna go ahead and pray holy spirit holy angels Archangel Michael, Archangel Raziel, Archangel Raphael, Archangel Gabriel, Archangel Metatron, I ask you to sing your greatest white light and please give me clear and precise messages. Protect my crown chakra, protect my throat chakra, protect my heart chakra, protect me from any harm or entity that does not want me to speak, that does not want me to get messages out. This is for a married man, okay? This message is for a married man. The enemy does not want me to get this message out. For whatever reason, I don't know. But I'm hearing this is a warning. And this is a final countdown to a married man between the ages of 50 to 65 or 70. This man can be between the ages of 50 to 70. This is a married man. This man could be younger, does not matter. But this man is married. This man is about to meet his demise and I'm seeing a death. This man could have spiritually been attacking someone close to them. This man could have attacked their um, sibling. This man could have attacked their own mother. This man could have attacked their own daughter, their own son. This man is very bitter. Uh, that's what I'm hearing. One second, you guys. When I tell you the enemy do not want me to get this out, like I can literally like feel the negative energy in the anointing, in the spirit. So I'm going to try to put this out slowly because I'm hearing this is like the final countdown. This is somebody's last warning. So the download that I have been getting is I keep seeing the movie um, set it off. And I keep seeing the scene in the movie where uh, Queen Latifah, Jada Pinkett, and all of them went to that hotel room. I got to pray again, you guys. I don't know what it is because it's like I was very cool, calm, and collected. And I really got chills up my spine right now. I don't know who this message is for. Spirit, I just ask you to rebuke any negative energy that does not want me to get this out. But this is for a married man. And I'm hearing... This is your last warning to stop or quit whatever you're doing. Because I'm hearing the Grim Reaper is on your neck. This man could have got his mother killed or murdered for insurance money. This man is involved with a lot of shit, a part of his community. This man could be a mason or a part of some type of secret organization or society. I feel like this could be an older man. This could be an elderly man. This could be somebody's uncle. This could be somebody's brother. This could be somebody's father. I literally got chills up my spine. But the download that I got was, again, um, I kept seeing that movie. Uh, I kept seeing the movie set it off in my head where Queen Latifah and all of them went to that hotel room and they were looking for Luther. And they was asking Luther, what the fuck did you do with our money? Where the, mon where the money at Luther? And remember, he was sleeping with that prostitute. So what spirit is telling me is there's some older ass man. Again, this could be a young man, but there is a older man that's been sleeping with prostitutes. This man is married. This man likes to pick up hookers, prostitutes, and he has sex for them. 
He has sex with them and he pays them money. Somebody, I, I don't know. I don't know what this person does or what this person is into, but they're into a lot of weird ass shit. This man could also be gay. I feel like this is an older man. This man is bisexual, but I feel like this man could hide his bisexuality because of his age. Like he may, he may have been born doing like the fifties or the sixties. He doesn't want anybody to know that he likes men and women because of his, his age and his upbringing. And you know, people that are born in the fifties and sixties, they got different values and morals and shit. I feel like somebody is about to be, man, I don't know what this is, but somebody is going to be found dead in a hotel room the same way that they killed Luther and set it off when he stole all their money. This man dibbles and dabs in a lot of shit. This could be somebody's husband. Okay. I don't know. I feel like whoever this man is married to, this man is married to a witch. This man could could be trying to um this man's wife could be trying to set him up. This man's wife may be the person that's setting him up to get killed. This man could be sick. This man could have some type of psychological issues or early early dementia or something like that. I feel like this man's wife, this man could have step stepchildren. I feel like this man and his 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 wife, this man's wife and her stepchildren could be trying to set this man up to get killed or murdered. Like somebody plays clueless. Like this person's wife may know that they cheat with prostitutes and hookers, but they don't never say nothing. They keep it to themselves. But I feel like there's some type of setup here for insurance money. It's a lot of shit going on. I don't know who this man is, but you better stop sleeping with prostitutes. You better stop cheating on your wife because your wife, I feel like this person's wife could be cheating on them anyways. These people could both be cheating on each other, but I feel like your wife knows what you do. And I feel like somebody's wife could be a lot younger than them, maybe five, 10 or 15 years younger than them. So our older men could have married a younger lady. This woman does spell work on you to cause you to be sick, to cause you to have some type of chemical imbalance. This this woman does a lot of spell work. This woman could have even did spell work on the relationship with your own biological children. I'm hearing something is going to be exposed on the news as well. I feel like somebody is trying to kill somebody for insurance money. There is a younger woman here that married an elderly man for money. But it's like this man, the spell work that this this woman is doing, I'm hearing death spells. They're not working fast enough. So this woman is trying to think of another setup. I'm hearing somebody's son or daughter could be incarcerated. I feel like somebody could have did some type of spell work to get somebody's adult to get somebody adult child put in jail or put into prison. I don't I don't know what the fuck is going on, but I've been hearing because I heard earlier that there's some type of battle of the sexes or some type of battle of the exes going on right now. It's like these people that's in karmic relationships and shit, they beefing hard. I'm hearing something about Jay-Z and Beyonce as well, even though they don't got nothing to do with this particular channel message. But these karmic people that it's like a lot of these people that they were never supposed to be in a marriage. They were never supposed to be in these relationships. They're karmic. And now these two karmic ass couples, it's a bunch of these couples. They beefing with each other. It's like tit for tack. And then it's sad because they're involving their children, whether they're babies or adult children or teenage children. These people like to involve their children. These children adult or, or babies they're innocent i don't know but uh whoever you are man these people gonna kill you because you owe somebody or something a lot of fucking money i feel like you promised somebody a lot of fucking money somebody is married to a money hungry ass bitch and this this woman is younger than you she wants you dead because whatever death spell she's doing, crazy spells, crown chakra magic, whatever this woman is doing, you're not dying fast enough. This woman wants to kill you and cash in insurance, an insurance policy and give it to her and her children and her and her family. This woman wants you dead, but you're not dying fast enough. So this woman is planning some type of setup. 
I'm hearing something about Motel 6. Somebody may go to work or somebody may act like they go to work and they prick, they pick up prostitutes. I'm literally seeing somebody be found dead in a hotel room. I don't know. Somebody could be dibbling, dabbling in drugs as well. Somebody may not even have a drug history, but they're starting to do drugs. It's like, again, y'all got to be careful what you try to put on people. If y'all out here wishing people get get on drugs and lose their mind and go crazy, it's happening to you. Bro, this shit is sad what I'm picking up on. That's why the enemy don't want me to get this out because it's like, damn, the shit that these people be trying to put on to y'all chosen one is happening to them and they can't even fucking handle it but i don't know who this elderly man is this could be somebody's uncle father brother cousin friend homeboy stop picking up prostitutes man because somebody and i feel like somebody has a favorite prostitute that they 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 normally see or they normally pay i feel like there's a lot of people in this energy that's about to be homeless as well for trying to cause other people to be homeless it's a lot of people it's like damn man it's going to be some stuff you're going to see that's going to make it hard to smell. It's a lot of people up under judgment, man. It's a lot of people in trouble. It's a lot of people that's going to the feds. It's a lot of people that's about to pass away. I'm hearing they die in threes. It's a lot of people scared because they know what they did to work in cahoots to get rid of the chosen one. And some of our chosen ones are no longer with us anymore. Some of our fellow chosen ones are in the afterlife and they will get justice. They will be vindicated for all the wrongdoing all the hurt and the harm that you tried to cause these anointed individuals. I'm also hearing there is a divine masculine that's waiting on somebody. I'm channeling right now. It's like there is a divine masculine. It's like they're not waiting on a divine feminine to come towards them. This man already knows he has to go towards a divine feminine, but he's working on some type of strategy. I'm hearing that strategy will be completed in divine timing. I'll leave that at that. I'm hearing something about a divine reconciliation. But I'm going to leave that alone. I feel like that's, that's sacred. Bear with me, you guys. I got my eyes closed that I'm channeling. Somebody can have a red Ford pickup truck. Or somebody can have a Nissan Altima. Or somebody could have some type of truck, like a, I don't know, a Kia or something like that. Somebody pays for sex because they're not satisfied at home or they're not really attracted to their wife. Somebody only married somebody because they got old. Somebody only married this younger woman for stability so they can look good on paper. But somebody is bisexual. There is an elderly man that's into the same sex as well as women. Somebody may find out that their father or their uncle was sleeping with their husband or sleeping with their spouse. It's a lot of shit going on. I don't know what this shit is I'm picking up on. I'm literally seeing somebody. Somebody going to be found dead in a hotel room. And whoever this is, for some apparent reason, I don't even feel like this person is going to see this message or hear this message. Whoever this man may be. Somebody's name could be Kenneth. Somebody's name could be Rodney. Somebody's name could be Corey. Somebody name could be Fernando or Oscar, Emilio. Somebody last name could be Rodriguez. Somebody name could be Courtney. Somebody is somebody. Um, somebody's brother name could be Courtney. It's a man, but their name is Courtney. I don't know. Something finna be on the news. I'm hearing something is about to be on the news in the next 24 hours, or the next 48 days, or 90 days. Somebody is thinking about committing suicide or, or driving off a bridge or somebody is trying to drive somebody off a bridge. Somebody is thinking about committing suicide or faking their death or going on the run because they don't want to go to jail. It's a whole group of people that's scared right now. That's real scared. And I'm hearing you should be because you know what you've been you know what you've been participating in and you know what you've been doing. But to this elderly ass man, your wife is setting you up. Your wife is mad. This woman does death spells on you. Death magic. This woman does not like you. This woman is younger than you. This woman don't like you, nor do her kids like you. This woman and her children are trying to get rid of you for insurance money. I'm, I'm seeing somebody have a massive heart attack. This woman is trying to think of every fucking way. It's like, why is this woman doing this? 
But I'm seeing in my third eye this. Oh, this woman is doing this because she has a secret lover. I mean, secret lovers. That's what we are. Na, 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 na. Uh, 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 uh. Why am I hearing that? Secret lovers. The Apollo Theater could be significant. Somebody could be a musician in this energy. Somebody could do music. I feel like somebody could have promised somebody a certain type of lifestyle. Somebody promised somebody that they would be rich and they would be seen all over the world, all over TV. Somebody promised somebody. I'm hearing somebody say, when I become famous, when I become rich, I'm going to take care of you. I'm hearing something about the Playboy Mansion or uh, somebody is elderly. I don't think the Playboy Mansion got anything to do with anything, but I feel like there is an older man that married a younger woman. Somebody promised somebody a lavish lifestyle. There is a younger woman that only married this older man for money. And I feel like somebody couldn't provide that lifestyle because they didn't want to sell their soul or they just, I don't know. They got too they got too caught up with dibbling and dabbling with other things, scheming and scamming. Somebody also killed their own mother too. Somebody literally had their own mother killed because they have some type of resentment or hate towards their mother. Somebody could have been molested as a child by their father and their mother could have swept it under the rug. So this person plotted to kill and take out their own mother. Somebody poisoned their own mother in a hospital or a nursing home. This person is going to jail for that. But I don't feel like this person is even going to make it to jail because this person's wife is trying to kill them. I'm hearing this person's wife is plotting real hard to get some type of insurance money or some type of insurance policy. What the fuck is this? I'm channeling real hard right now. Somebody's name could be Kimberly. I feel like this woman, I'm seeing all of these plots. This woman is trying to poison this man. I'm seeing somebody have a massive heart attack in a kitchen. I'm seeing some, I'm seeing an elderly man fall out in the kitchen from a heart attack. And I don't feel like this person is going to have a heart attack because they just had a heart attack. Their body just gave out. This woman is poisoning somebody. This woman can literally be poisoning this man. Somebody could be sleeping with a psychiatrist or a doctor. I don't know. Somebody could be sleeping. I don't know. I'm channeling right now. Somebody could be sleeping with a psychiatrist. So if you have a psychiatrist or this person has a psychiatrist, somebody is sleeping with a man. Some I, I don't know what the fuck this is. It, this is this is too much. This is this is just too much. If you're resonating with any of this, put this in a comment section. But this woman is trying to it's like, I don't know, this woman is planning on poisoning this man. If that doesn't work, I feel like this woman poisons, poisons this man all the time. This is like some Hugh Hefner weird type Anna Nicole type shit. Like somebody marries older men or preys on older men for their money. But I feel like whoever this older man is, they're a karmic. I feel like this could be somebody that's a half-assed father. This is somebody that never took care of their children or never cared for their children. They could have did the bare minimum, like paid child support, but that was it. Whoever this man's wife is, this, this woman is planning to poison this man. And I feel like this woman has been poisoning this man. But it's like this man, it's like this poison is reject. This man is rejecting this poison. This man can have chest pains a lot, back pains a lot, outbreaks a lot. Somebody may get a lot of STDs a lot. This man gets a lot of STDs a lot because they sleep around with prostitutes and possibly some type of psychiatrist. Somebody is sleeping with some, 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 somebody is sleeping with their psychiatrist or a doctor as well. So this man may have a lot of doctor visits or I don't know, man, it, it, there, there's a lot coming out, man. If this woman cannot successfully poison this man because I'm seeing it, this woman is planning on setting this man up with some type of prostitute or decoy. There's like one there's a Pacific woman or man that this that that, that this this could even be the psychiatrist or doctor. This 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 man sneaks and sleeps with this doctor or this psychiatrist or this prostitute or both. I feel like this man's wife is going to pay this man's doctor or psychiatrist or this prostitute to set this man up. I'm literally seeing somebody like slumped over. Somebody going to get shot with a with a shotgun or a nine millimeter or something like that. I'm here. 
Wow, this man's wife may even pull the trigger. I don't fucking know what this is. This has something to do with money. This woman is mad because this man promised her, this man sold her a dream. So this man could have met this woman when he was younger, when she was a lot more younger. They could have met early, maybe in the early 2000s. I'm here in 2007, 2008. Somebody promised somebody. I'm hearing something like, I don't know, when this man met this woman, he could have said, hey, I can buy you this. I can buy you that. I'm going to be rich. I'm going to be a millionaire. And that never happened. This person never became rich and famous. This person, this, this, I'm sorry to say this, but somebody is going to be found dead in a hotel room or they're going to die from a heart attack. If this man ends up being found dead in a hotel room from sleeping with this prostitute, I'm hearing this man's doctor or psychiatrist is setting them up as well as their wife, maybe even their ex-girlfriend or one of their baby mamas. Somebody has multiple children. I feel like there is a whole community that's setting this man up. This man owes a lot of people a lot of money and he didn't he didn't make good on it. He can even owe the dope man money. This man could be dibbling and dabbling in drugs. This could be a functioning drug addict as well. There's a lot of people that setting this man up for insurance money. This man is either going to die from uh, being shot and killed in a hotel room from sleeping with a prostitute or they're going to die from a heart attack from being poisoned. And sad that it is, I don't think somebody is going to even get this message. This is a warning. I don't know, but I don't even feel like you're going to be able to go on the run. You're not going to be able to escape this. I feel like you only got uh, jail or you're going to be dead. That's your only choice. Because I feel like there is an elderly man out here between the ages of 50 to 65 or 70 or maybe even younger or 40. This could be a young man that has an old soul as well. You set up your mom to get killed. I feel like somebody sacrificed their own mother for money because they were desperate for money. Somebody owes a lot of people a lot of money. I feel like somebody was fronted a lot of money throughout the years. Somebody could have had multiple businesses like clubs, bars. I'm hearing somebody could have been in the uh, entertainment industry. So I'm hearing somebody didn't make good on these loans. Somebody didn't make good on this money. This man owes an occult. Several people are part of some type of town, neighborhood, city, community, state. This man owes a lot of people a lot of money. And he, it's time. It's time to pay the piper. The devil finna collect. And I feel like this man could have been trying to sacrifice their own son or their own daughter, their own children. This man is trying to sacrifice anybody. They recently sacrificed their own mother. They're trying to sacrifice anybody because they got to pay their karmic debt. These occults, these secret organizations and societies, they want money. I'm hearing this man's psychiatrist or doctor, they want money as well. I'm also hearing that, um, damn. So this I'm channeling. So this elderly man could have had something to do with this psychiatrist or doctor's family members being killed or taken out as well. Somebody wants blood. It's a lot of people in high places that want blood, including this man's wife. This man's wife want blood because they were promised some type of lifestyle. I feel like this man's wife is good. This could even be this man's long term girlfriend. There could be some type of illegal marriage here as well. I feel like this man's wife. Somebody's going to end up going to jail. So if somebody wrote out a will, say, for instance, your uncle or your father or your cousin or whatever the fuck, whoever this man is, they could have wrote out a will and left you something. They could have put you in a will. This man may not be dead or they may not be deceased, but I feel like this man's wife is planning on taking everything from them, including this man's children. I don't know, but I don't know what the fuck this is. I swear to God, from the I have no idea <laughs> what this is, but uh somebody somebody finna die. I don't feel like this person is gonna make it to jail. I feel like this person this person is th th somebody's gonna end up somebody will be wanted for murder in the next 30 days. The next 30 to 45 days. I'm hearing by Christmas, somebody's gonna have a warrant out for their arrest for murder, for unaliving their own mother. Somebody could have worked with their siblings to do this. Somebody is somebody is going some somebody. I don't know. Somebody is going to have a warrant out for their arrest for trying to murder their own mother, possibly even set up some type of murder or unaliving of one of their children. 
It's several people here that's finna go to the feds, that's finna go to jail. I feel like this person's wife could be working with their doctor, their psychiatrist, maybe a baby mama, an ex-girlfriend, a community. All of these people are trying to sacrifice this man. I'm hearing they didn't they, they didn't they didn't make good on a loan. They owe too much money to do to, to to too many people. I'm seeing that movie, The Five Heartbeats in my head and where uh, Red was like, uh, my office hours are from nine to five. I'm literally seeing an elderly man go visit somebody in the office and say, hey, I could pay I could pay you the money back. Just give me some time. Just give me some time to pay the money back. I don't have it right now. I, I don't have it right now. Somebody could have literally set up wax. Well, I don't know what the fuck this is, bro. You karmic. This is too much, bro. Somebody's wife is working with their doctor, their psychiatrist. I got chills up my spine. Somebody is working with a whole community to sacrifice somebody because they're money hungry. I feel like this bitch is going to end up going to jail. Because if this man ends up passing away, if they left any type of money to any other relative or their living children or anything like that, this woman plans on taking it and keeping it for herself and her family or her children if she has children. Whoever this doctor is, whoever this lawyer is, whoever these high government officials is, they want their money back. They, this person couldn't pay the loan back. I don't know. I'm here. It's time for the devil to collect. And this person might not even owe no fucking money. It's just time for the devil to collect. It's time to pay the piper because this man could have literally put up one of their children as a sacrifice. But I, I'm hearing that the sacrifice wasn't able to be completed. So this person is going to end up being sacrificed. Somebody has been trying to sacrifice their son. I'm seeing a male or this could be their daughter or somebody is trying to sacrifice all of their children. I don't fucking know. Somebody most definitely sacrificed their mother because they owe money. They need money to pay these these high officials, these occults off. They, they need money to pay this secret society off. I'm telling you, somebody is going to be wanted for murder, for the murder of their own mother. Somebody's mother could have been poisoned. Or beat to death. This is an elderly woman between the ages of 75 to 80 or 90. I'm here 75 to 90. Somebody, I'm telling you, some, this is going to be on the news. Somebody is going to be wanted for uh, sacrificing their own mother. I don't know, but this man is finna pass away. It's time for the devil to collect. Peace.